the eye that sees, the eye God gave you at salvation. And when eternal life comes into a man, he exposes you to three cardinal things that can help your eyes. One, he gives you dimension of knowledge. He gives you ability to begin to assess knowledge. John chapter 17, from verse 1 to 3, the Bible says, this is life eternal, which is to know you. That means eternal life exposes us to a system of knowledge that is sequential, that is progressive in the kingdom. Then number two, eternal life brings us to a place of sonship. Manifestation 11. He said he came to his own, and his own received him not, but as many that received him to them. Oh, hallelujah. He said to them, Mahuski Bahaya. To them, he gave them power. The word power here is not dunamis, it's exusia. That means delegated authority. In other words, in the kingdom, authority speak, the knowledge of authority that you have and that you carry take you on, on a vantage position than even the anointing, than even your sonship. So in other words, that place of authority bring where your sonship begins to make effect. So born again is more than a church slogan. Born again is more than God forgiving you your sins. No, sir. Forgiveness of sin is a ticket to a certain realm to position you in a place of sonship. Sonship break protocols. The knowledge of your sonship can break every protocol that exists in your natural bloodline.